Hey world, how's it going? What are you up to today? Are you doing anything different? I turned on the camera and I have absolutely nothing to say, but I always seem to have something going on in my mind, so I figured why not turn on the camera and see what the fuck comes out my mouth today. So what are you guys up to? Are you doing good? I'm doing decent. I am doing my best to remain positive and embrace change. Because I talk about it all the time about how change is hard, right? Change is really hard. It's scary because you never know what's around the corner. And people get used to doing the same thing over because they know what to expect. So they know how to prepare for it. But if you don't ever go out of your comfort zone and try new things, you could really be missing out on a lot of opportunities. So I am trying to embrace change, um, also spiritual change within, not just like my physical uh, outcomes of stuff, but my internal being. Because the only person that can change yourself is yourself. You know, people sometimes will say, oh, if you love me, you'll change for me. No, if you love yourself, you'll change for yourself. Know thyself. So, yeah, so I'm trying to embrace change, take on some new opportunities, but I'm scared. I'm scared because of the what ifs, but also I'm scared to remain the same because I know that that is just going to cause me to become stagnant. And that's not something I want at all. I want to have a full life. I want to be able to look back at life and not say, damn. I wish I would have done that. I wish I would have done this. I wish I would have seized this opportunity. Because some things only come around once in a lifetime. And you want to set yourself up to receive your blessings, not miss them. You know. So, I don't know. I'm, I'm just trying to embrace change. One of the things I'm trying to change is the internal battle I have since since I suffer from depression, because I beat myself up a lot. I will tell myself, you're not smart enough. You can't do it. And I do have a bit of a handicap in that I have a learning disability. I do not have a mental disability. I'm capable of learning, but I do have a learning disability. I'm dyslexic. I learn a bit slow. So it takes me a while to catch on to things. And sometimes people could get really frustrated with me and be like, fuck it, never mind. Um, but those who hang with me know that once I catch on to something, I master it very quickly once I've got the general concept of it. So part of that is having a good teacher. Um, so I've been looking for guidance from a lot of different uh, sources, but really I know that the change comes from within. It's not going to come from a book. It's not going to come from a master teacher. It's going to come from my internal being, but I have to come to a place of understanding and inner standing and then overstanding in order to move forward and, and build a better me. Tasha, the dog is barking. Ugh. Anyway, she's always barking. You know how chihuahuas are. It's the smallest dogs who think that they're the biggest. They have the biggest personalities. But that just goes to show you don't have to be big and bad to make shit happen. You could be the smallest one in the group and still be the shit. <laughs> Anyway, I'm just saying hello, good morning, reach for your dreams, don't be afraid to try new things, and if you are afraid to try new things, try to push yourself past your comfort zone. Even if it's baby steps, give it a shot, or maybe you just gotta be like Nike and just do it, just, you know, make that change. That's also Michael Jackson, so, you know, I'm <laughs> gonna make a change. <laughs> For once in my life. Yes, yes. 
So growth, don't be afraid to grow. I just hope these don't grow anymore. Okay, that was unnecessary, but look, I'm, I'm, <laughs> never mind. Have a good one. Peace. <laughs>